Scientists have found a way to create diamonds from pet plastics. Now, turning plastic into diamonds seems like something straight out of a modern fairy tale, but an experiment that was originally designed to better understand the planets known as the ice giants like Uranus and Neptune led to this unexpected discovery. These scientists were investigating a phenomenon called diamond rain, which is believed to form with a unique mix of elements within these planets. They ran the experiment using pet plastic, the polymer which is found in packaging and water bottles. The team managed to mimic the process that happens within the ice giants by creating a high-pressure shock wave using an optical laser on the plastic. Can you imagine two million elephants jumping on an object at the same time? That's the kind of pressure we're talking about. Researchers were excited when this produced tiny synthetic diamonds. What's really extraordinary is the clarity of the results they saw. A large fraction of carbon atoms turned into diamonds merely within nanoseconds. Also when the pressure is released, the diamonds remain, which means there are ways to retain them and maybe use them for other things. Man-made diamonds have very similar properties to that of natural diamonds. So apart from being very pretty, these nano diamonds have potential applications in quantum technology and medical science. These experiments were set up to get a better understanding of the planets in our solar system. This is yet another example in the history of science where our curiosity to learn about something so distant could lead to real-world applications right here on Earth. If this turns out to be an efficient way of producing nano-diamonds out of the same plastic that goes into landfill every year, this could be a great news for our planet. So, can you think of any other invention or technology that we have today because of space exploration? Let us know in the comments. Make sure you subscribe to the world of science. Until next time, stay scientific.